I'm Pam on Sunset. Today we're making a DIY Christmas pillowcase. Merry Christmas! Today's tutorial is coming from MaisonDepex.com. Ooh, French. Ooh la la. I'm one of those people who loves decorating for holidays, but I don't want to put like a million lights outside where you're like, this pillowcase tutorial seemed perfect because you could just throw it on your throw pillow and take it off a few weeks later. You need a blank pillowcase, a stencil, scissors, and a sharpie. I picked a reindeer stencil. It seemed really cute, but not overly Christmas gimmicky. It's still chic. Say chic. And if we wish real hard, it might snow. <laughs> I think I have a piece of paper down my shirt. <laughs> and if you guys like this hat, you should go on Etsy at KM Knits. I know you guys think like, oh, she's in LA and she's wearing a hat, it's not that cold. I got wool socks on too, okay? It's freaking freezing in here. I wonder which reindeer this is. It could be Comet. Could be Donner, could be Blitzen, Cupid. Not Rudolph, because there's no red. I'm gonna say it's Comet, because Comet sounds cool. Now Comet is ready for flight. First step is to stencil our reindeer. If you like my reindeer, are you just happy to see me? I'm gonna do my reindeer up here, like he's flying. I probably should hold the stencil down with something, but I'm not going to. And let's see what happens. Oh my God. Yep, definitely should have taped or pinned this down. I <laughs> think the antlers are real messed up. Now I'm just gripping it for dear life because I don't want it to move. So on the website, she said she had a pillow decorating party, which sounded really fun. But I might do it for a different holiday. Like, I feel like at Christmas time, I have so many things to do, I don't have time to decorate a pillow. Even though I'm decorating a pillow now. Oh, it's cute, yay! So maybe you don't have to pin it down. Let's cut out some steps here. We have eggnog to drink. We have things to do. Oh, wait, this antler doesn't look right. Uh, I'm gonna color it in starting at the bottom and then see if I can figure out what to do about this antler at the top. Here's a list of everything I want for Christmas. A pony, 800,000 subscribers, Megan Reich's hair, Rosanna Benzino's cooking abilities, and a stable for the pony. Uh-oh, I'm getting to the antler part. I'm attempting to fix the antler. Oh no. It was so bad. I always get so close. I'm always so close. I'm like, yes, this is an easy one. I'm gonna do it perfectly. And then, wah, wah, fail. That's okay, because this that's what this channel is all about. We're real. We're real people. I'm a real girl. And there's probably gonna be something that you mess up about this tutorial. It doesn't look that bad, I don't think. And now I have to write something underneath it because this is not enough. If I left it like that, that would be sad. Hmm, what should I write on my pillow? Tis the season. I'm gonna write joy down here. No, I'm not. I don't wanna write joy. Son of a nutcracker. Uh, I feel like I want something with like magic. I don't know what to write. Ooh, sleigh bells ring. Now I'm gonna do a scary thing and freehand it. Maybe I should do it in pencil first. I'm gonna do it in pencil first. Make sure I spell it right. That would be hilarious. Yeah, see, I don't like this S. Good thing I did it in pencil. That looks stupid. Erase, 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 erase. Now I'm gonna do that in silver. That's cute. I kinda wanna make the dust of the eyes a bell. But I don't know if I can draw a bell. Should I take the risk? I'm gonna pencil it first. I think I can do it. It's a circle with two lines 
and a dot. Does that look like a bell? No. That looks like it has a beak. Mm -hmm. Okay, no bell. There's no bells. We're just gonna dot it. It's so cute! You can even give this as a Christmas present. This tutorial was really easy. I highly recommend doing this one. My real girl tips are, the hardest part for me was to actually find the blank pillowcase. I ended up buying it from H&M online and it was pretty cheap, I think it was about $5. Now that I've done the tutorial, I almost wish that I had bought a blank but colored pillowcase, which is probably even harder to find. My second real girl tip is to figure out what you're drawing before you start drawing. I think I ended up with something that was really cute, but if you plan it out a little bit better, you probably would have more success. My third real girl tip is to make sure that you put the stencil down with tape or pins or something so that it's not moving around, because my comment ended up with a few extra antlers. So that's it. Please hit that subscribe button, that like button, and leave a little comment. Please, it's all I want for Christmas.